this is my off-grid system and this is my three years old lithium polymer pack and we are going to build a great battery monitor for it hi my name is Roland and this is going to be the start of a new project it will be a mini series about building of a uh, battery monitor and not just anything simple it will be actually based on a microcontroller but a very cost effective and as you know, microcontrol systems are as clever as the people uh, using their brains which are put inside of their chips. So this will be a video series. Each video will be pretty short. It will be just bite-sized, maybe maximum five minutes each. And we are going to tell about what we are doing, about the hardware which we are using, and then also uh, show the software and what we can do with this. So I will explain you short inside the power room uh, what is there now and uh, what we are going to improve. So for the time this is my battery monitor more or less. The only thing I have is a voltmeter. And with this voltmeter when the uh, system is idling I can go into my table and I can say okay that voltage means that state of charge. The only other thing I can do is, of course, look at the inverter and see how much uh, current is going in or out of the battery. But that's already it. The state of charge on this here is, of course, uh, not correct. Because this is just based on some curves for lead acid batteries, etc. What I want to have here now instead of this is a really intelligent uh, battery monitor which will show us the total voltage, the current in and out, the calculated state of charge and calculated real cycles based on the energy flow and then we will have two temperatures. This one here is the inverter temperature which has a sensor here and so we will keep that one and we will also put one sensor into the battery pack somewhere there so we know the temperature inside so that is the plan uh, how we will uh, change this hardware here why do I want to make this by myself isn't there anything on the market uh, which can do this well there's cheap Chinese uh, battery monitors which are working like column meters but they are usually very inaccurate I have one in the other power wall and that one is drifting by 1% a day uh, which is quite a lot and the other thing is that there's no meter on the market on the low price range which can be connected to the Wi-Fi and monitored online right and we are going to do this we will use the app Blink uh, which is uh, an IoT app which I also use already for my other power wall that we can monitor all these values straight on our phones okay that was it already for the, today's video so we keep it very short Please uh, give me a thumbs up if you like uh, this project, uh, subscribe so that you don't miss any further part of this and uh, I see you next time.